Welcome to the AFN Europe Report. I'm Senior Airman Cameron Nee Warner. Teamwork and education were just some of the elements in exercise Lisa Azul, which recently concluded in Spain. U.S. Marines assigned to Fleet Anti-Terrorism Security Team Company Europe worked alongside Spanish and Italian Marines as part of the exercise in Rota, Spain. This training exercise focuses on a variety of skills such as non-lethal combatives, live fire, helicopter rope suspension, and more. The goal is to sustain interoperability amongst U.S. and partner forces in support of future operations. It's important to have that relationship, uh, to understand how they work, they understand how we work. In the event that something like that were to happen, we do have that relationship and that mutual level of respect that will carry us leaps and bounds in the future. Threats can come from anywhere, to include high in the mountains. Staff Sergeant Brandon Rickard shows us how U.S. and Italian soldiers are training to stay ready. The scout platoons from 1st and 2nd Battalion of the 503rd Airborne Infantry Regiment participated in several exercises with the Alpini across multiple training sites in northern Italy. They brought more wood to, to block this side of objective gold. One of them was Operation Vertigo, a demonstration of interoperability in front of local officials and foreign military leaders from across Europe. It's been incredible. I've been very fortunate to be able to work with the Alpini specifically for the past year. I couldn't have asked for a better job in the Army. It's very interesting. The Italian Army is uh, it's a lot older, uh, I'd say a lot more mature than normal American soldiers are, but we kind of come in with more fitness and more tactical knowledge. So it's, it's a good conglomeration of experience and youth and knowledge. From the Dolomites, Staff Sergeant Brandon Ricker. That's all for the AFN Europe Report. Thanks for watching.